Jeffrey says that one hour of video games at night isn't a problem. But he plays four, five, six, and he delays his bedtime, and then he wakes up feeling fatigued and f up. And then the Jeffreys might say, oh, well, well, if you just play one hour a day, then it's okay. It's never one hour. Come on, if you've been a video gamer, you know. One hour is not enough. You know that no, it takes like five, it. ten minutes no, to even, like, get inside, like, get into the game. And you have to wait 20 minutes for your dumbass friend who's making food. No one is playing one hour no, but, a day. But Baham said, like, you could have a lot of fun on RuneScape and it helped you grow into the person you are, and you could be yeah, great. But you're like Jeffrey, and you believe that video games aren't that bad. If I only play one hour a day, they're not that bad. But Baham said, I only play there was a study that said if if uh, you someone plays games every day then they've got better hand eye quarter shut up bro better better hand eye oh but video gamers have got better shut up bro pussy like you just bring it up like unnecessary like oh they, they, they've got better reflexes like shut up like when when is reflexes a skill that you really really wanted to level up it's just your excuse to say oh but there is a there is an advantage shut up Hamza, there, 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 there's a successful guy who plays shut up bro there's a, there's a successful guy who plays who plays games, so you're wrong, Hamza. Don't bring up some anecdotal evidence like, oh yeah, there's this one guy who makes 17 million a year and, and he plays video. Shut up, bro. Oh, but one hour a night isn't bad. They are, but you're wrong because I'm allowed to have an hour of, of resting time, but it's not rest. I'm allowed to have an hour of fun, but it's not even fun. Oh, I, I only play for one hour at the end of, you know, a hard day of work. You're like, oh, but it's not so bad. Like, yeah. But it helps you with your hand-eye coordination and your memory and just shut They're, up. Oh, but what if you just play one hour a day? You know, there's always the same comment that they say, but, you know, I meditate, I exercise, but I just play one hour a day. It's not even bad, Hamza. You're like, you're blowing it, like, you're over-exaggerating how worse it is. The fact that you need to write an excuse like that, the fact that you need to say, oh, but look at me, I, I, I'm really good in the rest of my life, so it's not that bad, is it, guys? shows that you already know that it's an inherently a bad habit. It's not one hour. Stop lying. Oh, but Hamza, X plays video games. Elon Musk plays video games. Michael Jackson plays... I don't give a fuck what they that, do. Oh, but I'll become an esports player. Fuck you. You play video games. There's a difference. They're working. Video games are good for you because, you know, three reasons why video games are good for you because it helps with your memory. Fuck you. But it teaches you concepts and, you know, all this, like, artistic uh, inspiration. Shut the fuck up, bro. But Hamza, I read and I play video. Shut the fuck up. Oh, but, you know, they've worked hard and it's just one hour to unwind and rest before the end of the day. He plays for three hours, but he plays for one hour. He promises you he plays for one hour, but he plays for, like, three to four hours. So this idea that, oh, but it's just one hour to unwind. No. It's one hour wasted of hyperstimulation, but it keeps you up longer. I know that you need the rest of them wine because you're sleep deprived because you keep playing video games. And you know, the cure to sleep deprivation, you know when you really, really want to rest and you really want to sleep, you know what you should do? Go to sleep.